Hello and welcome everybody to another video review. This time of Transformers Generations Orion Packs. This is of course the pre-prime form of Optimus Prime and it's largely inspired by the IDW comics. He rolls kind of okay. It's a bit iffy especially with front wheels. He does have painted rims which look very nice. And a clear section here, although technically it isn't a cockpit. For accessories, he comes with this axe, which people I know have stated this, at, that kind of looks like a guitar. And the gun, which kind of looks like a shorter version of G1 Prime's gun. So, to transform this figure, unpeg the arms from the back, fold them forward to get them out of the way, unclip the front bumper, fold it out and down, flip out the feet from the bottom of the truck and spin them around, and peg, come on, if you can find them, please pass the wheels, peg them in the legs, and uh, fight the tabs to split the legs. Fold the torso, okay, that was off camera, fold the torso up, fold these wheels back, Clip the torso into place, flip up the head, if you can get to flip up, rotate the waist around, peg the arms into place with some not very good connections, come on, and flip out the fists. Again, sorry if this is all off camera. And there you have Generations Ryan Pax in his robot mode. For articulation, he has a ball joint in the neck, universal swivel shoulders, uh, a bicep rotation, a 90 degree, kind of semi ratcheted elbow joint, and the wrist swivel. The waist has a swivel. Ball jointed hips with a sole right beneath. Alright, come on. Pretty good range on the knees. Although they're very they're very tight. And ball jointed and hinged ankles. So this guy has really good articulation. Especially for a dogs. He can, of course, hold his weaponry, although he can't really store it in this mode. So, should you get this figure? Um, yeah, he's a pretty good toy. Personally, when this came out, I expected him to repaint his cup. In fact, I assumed this was just like a, like a Combiner Wars Optimus Prime, where they re released the version that you'd think would be a repaint prior. Anyway, this is definitely a recommended figure. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.